Dr. Rena Ziade. When it comes to taking care of asthma, there are three things that are very important. Always have your medicines on hand. Know how to use your medicines to control your asthma symptoms. Know how and when to get help when you need it. Working with you as a team, we at Children's Hospital of Pittsburgh and Children's Community Pediatrics can help you keep your asthma under control. Here's more information about the importance of using a spacer device with inhalers from asthma specialist John Broyles. She really doesn't need a spacer. She can do it without it. Giving the proper medication is important and giving it properly is just as critical. When you press down on that inhaler, it comes out at 60 miles an hour. That's way too fast for anyone to be able to inhale it into their lungs, which is where it needs to go. Without a spacer, it goes everywhere but the lungs and comes right back out. You may even swallow some of it. Sometimes asthma control can be easily obtained just by using the spacer properly. When you first get an inhaler, you have to shake it up really well and give four quick squirts to prime it. Okay, then you shake it really well before each use after that. This is an air chamber, it's a little spacer. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna pop this into the back end, close off that end, and on this end here, there's a little one-way valve that's gonna close off there. So what I want you to do is first, you're gonna blow out all your air. Put your mouth on here, and then I want you to sip it in like you're pulling in from a straw, nice and slow. As deep as you can, and hold it till I count to 10, okay? Then so blow out all your air first. We're gonna put this between your teeth. Give a squirt. Now slow, deep breath in. Now hold it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome. Let it out. Wait a minute or two, and we're going to do the exact same thing again. Okay? Blow out all your air first. We're going to put this between your teeth. Give a squirt. Okay. Now the big breath in. Now hold it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome. That was very good. Now, if you weren't able to use the mouthpiece, we also have a spacer that looks like this. It works the same way. We're going to put the inhaler into the back here, but instead of trying to put this in your mouth, this is going to just fit over your face real nice like that, okay? So then we would give you a squirt, but instead of trying to take a really big breath in and holding it, I want you to take six really big breaths in and out. One, two, awesome, keep going. Three, four, five, and one more, six. That was awesome, nice job. Hi, I'm Linda Earhart with the American Lung Association, Program Manager for Pennsylvania Asthma Partnership. I hope you found these videos helpful. For more information on how to stay healthy and gain control of your asthma, you can visit these websites chp.edu or paasthma.org.